Welcome back to my channel. So this video that I have for you guys today is actually a Desi Perkins inspired makeup look. I saw her New Year's Eve glitter liner makeup tutorial that she posted and for New Year's Eve I too decided to do a glitter liner. Mine is just pink. I did change up some of the steps. Obviously I did not use the same products but if you'd like to see my rendition of her glitter liner by pink version stick around and watch this. I've already gone ahead and primed my eyelid with the Essence I Love Stage eyeshadow base and I set that with a little bit of my Too Faced Born This Way uh, Ethereal Loose Setting Powder and we're going to go in with the first shade for the look and that is from the Morphe and James Charles palette. I did throw away the little plastic insert because it was annoying and I didn't feel like taping it inside so I'm just going to point the colors I'm using. I'm going over with this really light baby pink color. Right here, we're gonna take that on like a tapered blending brush and just kind of throw that into the crease. Um, this doesn't really do much for the whole look in general, but it just adds a nice little pink transition situation. And then we're gonna jump into the BH Cosmetics Take Me Back to Brazil palette. I don't think I've mentioned this in a video at all, but it is a really beautiful, colorful eyeshadow palette. It's really inexpensive, cruelty free, so. That's something you're interested in is like a really nice colorful palette besides the James Charles one. This one has a bit more like neon colors in it. I would suggest this. Um, I don't think this has any shade names on it. No. So once again, I'm just gonna point, I'm gonna be mixing these two colors right here. This is all matching and this one has like a very slight shimmery finish, but once you blend it out, you can't even see it. So it's perfect for this look. Really on like the outer portion. I'm gonna get back into the James Charles palette and use this color right here, which is like a really nice, like dusty rose mauve color. For this, we're really gonna focus this in the crease and in the outer V area. A bit more depth. Now, we're gonna use this color right here from the James Charles palette. It's like a really nice warm brown color. And we're gonna use a really small amount of this just in like the outer V area. And now I really wanna brighten up this inner lid area because I feel like it's just not as bright as I want it to be. So I'm gonna mix this white color right here along with this cream color up here. And just really like pat that on this inner portion right here. Before we go ahead and do the glitter wings liner, we're gonna add some color to our tight line. This is the ColourPop Cream Gel Liner in Pinky Pink. This is a really nice like orchid purple color that I think really complements the eye look. And my eye color too. To create a base for the actual winged liner, I'm going to be going into my CC Beauty Professional Cosmetics 12 color flash palette, which looks like this. It is a makeup forever alternative dupe, cruelty free situation. So I'm going to go in with this brown color right here. So, for the actual glitter on the liner, this is the Urban Decay Heavy Metal Glitter Liner in Cat Call. It's a really beautiful. Uh, glittery pink situation. So I went ahead and did my concealer, cream contour, bronzer, and brows off camera. I will have everything listed down below for you guys, the stuff that I didn't mention. So we're gonna go ahead and jump back into the eyes. For that, we're gonna be going in with that same brown cream color from my CC Beauty palette and that same really small brush. I'm just applying this very lightly in that outer waterline. And then we're gonna take a little bit of that and smudge it underneath the lash line, but only on that outer half. Like so. Just for a little bit of like a depth and dimension. 
And then to smoke that out, I'm going to be taking a mixture of this rose color right here that we used and this bigger color down here. Take it and very lightly set and smoke this outer portion out. I want the main focus to be on that glitter liner. So. I'm going to finish up the face before I put any mascara and setting spray on. So for blush, I can't remember exactly what I used when I did this look on New Year's Eve, but um, we're going to go with this really pretty pink blush from Wet n Wild. I will have the exact name listed down below, just because I've depotted mine and put it in a little palette. And this stuff is really pigmented. You don't need a lot of it. Um, so I'm going to wipe all that off. Just very lightly add some color. And this does have a little bit of like a shimmer to it, so it's a very nice, like, healthy, glowy looking blush. Next, we're going to add a little bit more glow to our skin, just because mine is very dry and I did use a matte foundation. For that, I'm going to go with this Laura Mercier Translucent Loose Setting Powder in Glow. So for a highlighter, I want to stick with that nice pink theme. I'm going to go in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills and Nicole Guerrero Glow Kits, and we're going to be using the colors Kitty Cat right here and Forever Young. Before I do mascara and lashes and lips. I'm going to go ahead and set my face with a combination of two setting powders. I have the Catrice Prime and Fine Matte Anti-Shine Fixing Spray and then over top of that I'm going to do a really 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 light layer of the Pixi Rose Glow Mist. So I do the uh, setting series before my mascara just because I don't want any of it to flick off and run down my face. For mascara, I am using the CoverGirl Peacock Flare Mascara. I've been trying this out and I've been really liking it so far. For lips, I'm going to go in with this NYX uh, lip liner in the color Mauve just to define my lips and add a little bit of color. And then for my actual lip color, I'm going to go in with this Milani lipstick in New York Creme, which you guys know is my favorite everyday color at the moment. I'm just gonna pat this over. This adds like a really nice like pink look. So New Year's Eve I did wear lip gloss. This is the Buxom lip gloss in white Russian. This is my absolute fave pink milky plumping gloss. So we're just gonna put a little bit on the center. I don't really like the lip gloss everywhere. Just like most of the center. So I'm going to go ahead and jump off camera, do my hair, put some jewelry on, change my top, and put my lashes on, and I'll be back to you up this video. Alright, so this is the complete look. I really hope you guys enjoyed this quick little tutorial on what I wore for New Year's Eve. It's a Zan Perkins inspired glitter liner. If you haven't subscribed already, please do it down below. I'll be doing a giveaway coming up very soon. Uh, my Instagram will also be linked down below if you'd like to follow me, as well as my vintage shop if you like shop any of the items in my closet so that is all i have for you guys and i'll see you next time